back to school, back to work for most folks after a long holiday weekend. How's it looking? We are looking at a mild start to the day and it's going to stay mild all day, but it's going to get a lot colder over the next 24 hours. Let's take a look at what's happening outside right now. Actually, let's take a, a look at the picture of the day. This is from Nicholas from Rumford and you can see this is a picture of the Blackstone River. A little bit of snow cover here on the banks. Beautiful picture. You are now entered into the uh, picture of the week which will be announced on Friday and the picture of the week winner will be uh, receiving a $100 gift certificate to Hunt's photo of Providence. Good luck, Nicholas. Gorgeous picture there. Live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar. Any of that snow that we had uh, from last week is gone. We've had some mild temperatures over the last 24 hours. Still mild. Live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar showing the absence of rain. We do have a little bit of sunshine though, but also lots of clouds. We'll see clouds and sunshine through the day, but probably more clouds than sun. 54 in Smithfield with a light wind at the moment. Mild there, mild in Taunton and New Bedford and Newport and Westerly. Temperatures are already above the average high temperature for the date. So it's a uh, very mild start and a threat tracker for today, tonight and Tuesday. Low chance of anything severe, although we are watching for the possibility of some snow Tuesday evening. I don't think it's going to amount to anything. I'm not expecting any accumulations, but uh, that snow should turn over to some rain. We'll talk about that more in just a second. You can see lots of clouds across the northeast, a stripe of cloudiness across New York and Pennsylvania associated with a cold front. Now the temperatures behind this front have been dropping significantly. It was 54 degrees at two o'clock in the morning in Syracuse, now down to 41. That kind of temperature change will be working its way into our area over the next 24 hours. Late this afternoon, the cold front comes through out ahead of it. A couple showers, maybe a few sprinkles. It'll be mild and then behind it, the colder air will begin to work its way into southern New England. Now we're going to be seeing some of the moisture that's going to hang back across New Jersey and the mid Atlantic states work its way into southern New England for tomorrow night. Might actually find a little bit of wet snow initially and then, then that will turn over to all rain. Let's take a look at this with our future cast. Here we are around noontime today. Sunshine mixing with some clouds uh, 430 this afternoon. Maybe Maybe a couple of brief showers or sprinkles and then partly to mostly cloudy during the overnight. Now tomorrow morning starting off with clouds, kind of cloudy all day. Now take note of what happens late afternoon, especially tomorrow evening. Maybe a little bit of wet snow mixing in with some rain, but this rain will take over throughout the daytime or excuse me, nighttime tomorrow night at the bus stops today in the 50s jacket, a sweatshirt, just a, a light shower during the afternoon hours. Uh, let's pinpoint the afternoon 57 degrees on the east side. Rumford about 57 over into Barrington across the bay into Warwick in the mid to upper 50s winds today from the west southwest 10 to 15 miles an hour, especially along the south coast could be a little gusty down here. 55 Charlestown, Newport 55 northern Rhode Island temperatures in the mid to upper 50s quick sprinkle or shower possible in the afternoon, but generally a dry day and a mild day, including over here in southeastern mass 57 and fall river Taunton 57. Same for New Bedford. Here's your live pinpoint Doppler 12 seven day future cast and we are looking at some cold weather for tomorrow or colder. I should say average high for the day is 48 degrees only 39 tomorrow for Wednesday. We are looking at milder weather going back above average temperatures will be topping out about 57 degrees. But the price that we pay for the warmth is some rain showers and clouds throughout the entire day. Won't be a complete washout, but there will be showers around through the day. And then it gets cooler after that for Thursday. And then it looks a little unsettled for Friday, Saturday and a Sunday. Maybe some rain and some snow showers at that time. You can get the updated future cast on our website at WPRI.com. Let's get an update now.